Hello guys, in the last video tutorial we covered creating a new company. In this video I would like to show you how to add a dispatcher. Now I do want to mention that in um, since previous video we have changed the layout of our overview page a bit. So as you can see there is a dispatcher link over here and there is a uh, passenger app section and so on. Um, so uh, uh, don't be frustrated. Um, all right, let's go to our dispatchers. Now, uh, as you can see, our new company has uh, zero drivers and no dispatchers. So uh, before you you can log in into the dispatcher application, you have to add yourself as a dispatcher, or you have to add an account that you would like to log in with as a dispatcher. So let's go on and do this. Uh, we got our email name and phone number uh, now I just want to repeat again that uh, this email guys should be a, a Google account a Google email or a Google Apps account email otherwise you won't be able to use it so um, yeah um, our dispatcher is invited and if we now switch to dispatcher application and try to log in with the same account then um, yeah, you can see that I'm able to access it and uh, I can create orders, right? So um, if we now go back and switch tabs just to update the tab, you can see that I'm active now since I have logged in first time. Um, now let's see what, I, what we can do with the dispatcher. Uh, we can, of course, change the information, we can delete him and we can suspend the dispatcher. Let's say um, let's say you want to suspend some worker that that is working um, from um, from from a distance place, um, and um, you don't want to delete him just right now, but you don't want him to use the system. So uh, what you do is you suspend him. Oh, sorry, some error. You suspend him, and uh, as you can see, the the now now our dispatcher has been locked off automatically and I won't be able to log in again as you can see uh, it, it is asking for company confirmation uh, so this is a nice feature if um, if for some reason you want to uh, suspend some dispatchers or operators from using your system right so uh, we just uh, resumed the guy and our total number of dispatchers is now one, which is correct, and uh, we are able to dispatch. Uh, so that's it, guys. In the next video, I will show you how to add a driver. See you.